Hello kids, Shubha Mangalam at Little Scholar High School. Myself, Mrs. Nasdina, taking standard first subject science. Standard first subject science. Today we will learn lesson number 12, new terms. Okay, lesson number 12. What is our lesson number 12? A N I M A L S animals. A N I M A L S animals. A N I M A L S animals yes where we see animals we see many variety many types of animals no near our house we will see yes in forest we'll see many animals i know also where animals live they live in forest some animals live near our house some animals live in our house yes and some animals we see in jungle forest and many animals all types of animals we can see in zoo yes you all like to see animals so we will go to zoo to see all types of animals yes the animals which are in forest you no know, we can't go and see in forest so the all wild animals will be kept in zoo so that people can come and visit the animals yes so now in this lesson we will learn about animals we will learn about animals a n i m a l s animals new terms g i r a f f e giraffe g i r a f f e giraffe g i r a f f e giraffe giraffe what you know no giraffe it will be very tall it has long neck yes giraffe e l e p h a n t elephant e l e p h a n t elephant yes elephant has a long trunk elephant has a long trunk r h i n o c e r o s rhinoceros r h i n o c e r o s rhinoceros r h i n o c e r o s rhinoceros see in your test book you can see animals page number 85 see in test book page number 85 this is giraffe so very tall animal and it has very long neck so which animal is this giraffe and which animal is this elephant which animal is this elephant which animal is this rhino rhinoceros now m o u s e mouse m o u s c mouse where you can see this giraffe in forest no in jungle and also in zoo elephant we can see elephant no elephant we see near our house also yes rhinoceros also in forest rhinoceros also in forest mouse m o u s c mouse mouse means big rat mouse means big rat rat you will see yes you, you see you no know, in our house also sometimes we see rats moving outside also we see rats moving rat is small but mouse is big in size s q u i r r e l squirrel s q u i r r e l squirrel s q u i r r e l squirrel squirrel lives on trees no lives on trees s q u i r r e l squirrel squirrel as bushy tail squirrel as bushy tail r a b b i t rabbit r a b b i t rabbit you can see in page number 86 see a mouse it is like rat only but big in size what is this this is squirrel it has bushy tail s q u i r r e l squirrel s q u i r r e l squirrel r a b b i t rabbit r a b b i t rabbit mouse squirrel rabbit mouse squirrel rabbit z e b r a zebra z e b r a zebra yes zebra will have black and white stripes zebra will have black and white stripes z e b r a zebra z e b r a zebra m o n k e y monkey 
M O N K E Y monkey. M O N K E Y monkey. T U R T L E turtle. T U R T L E turtle means tortoise. T U R T L E turtle. T U R T L E turtle. T U R T L E turtle. D O L P H I N dolphin. 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 Dolphin lives in water. Dolphin lives in water. See. See, these are animals which live in water. Yes, fish. Fish spelling. F I S H fish. F I S H fish. This is dolphin. D O L P H I N dolphin. D O L P H I N dolphin. And this is turtle. See turtle. You can see in water also. It lives on land and also it lives in water. T U R T L E turtle. T U R T L E turtle. This is tortoise, no turtle. Fish, dolphin, turtle. Fish, dolphin, turtle. Yes, say L A M A N D E R salamander. Yes, say L A M A N D E R salamander. Yes, say L A M A N D E R salamander. C R O C O D I L E crocodile. C R O C O D I L E crocodile. See, this is salamander. This is salamander. See how it is like crocodile, no? And this is crocodile. This is crocodile. This is salamander, like lizard, big lizard. Yes, big lizard. S A L A M A N D E R salamander crocodile C R O C O D I L E crocodile all these are what different types of animals different types of animals some animals we see moving on land some animals live in water yes where turtle lives where dolphin lives in water yes turtle dolphin where it lives in water F O R E S T forest. F O R E S T F O R E S T forest. What is forest? Many time many trees are growing together. No, in forest we can see many types of animals and birds living in forest. Yes, animals and birds living in forest. Forest is a place where thick for where many varieties many types of trees are growing together in one area large area it will cover all the trees will be there in very large area is covered with trees that is forest f o r e s t forest w i l d wild a n i m a l s animals w i l d wild a n i m A L S animals, wild animals. W I L D wild. W I L D wild. A N I M A L S animals, wild animals. Now say me what are wild animals? Animals that live in forest are known as wild animals. Animals that live in forest. Which animals live in forest? Lion, tiger, cheetah. leopard yes all these animals where they live they live in forest no jungle so they are known as wild animals they won't come near our house yes they will be in forest it's very dangerous no these animals may harm us so we won't keep that animals near our house they live in jungle they are known as wild animals animals that live in forest which are dangerous to human beings that animals live in forest they are known as wild animals they are known as wild animals wild animals like lion cheetah leopard all these animals they live in forest lion we see moving near our house 
no it's very dangerous no it will harm us it will kill us so these animals we will not allow them to come near our house they will be in jungle only so the animals that live in forest are known as wild animals f a r m s farms farm animals some animals live near our house yes some animals love hen some people have the habit of keeping hens no many hens they will keep they build a house for these animals yes hen to hen house is known as coop so they build a house for hen so that all the hens will keep will stay in that house goat those who take care of goats no they will build a house for the goat shed and they will keep all the goats in that place horse also they will keep so that is known as farm farm animals these farm animals are useful to us now hen why they keep so many hens because hen gives us egg and chicken hen gives us from hen we get eggs from hen we get chicken so they are useful to us the animals which are useful to us we keep them in farm they are known as farm animals yes now cow how cow is useful to us cow gives us milk yes so they built cow shed they built a shed house for cow the house of a cow is known as shed they built a shed for house so cow so that the cow can stay in that yes now how we need house no to live in in the same way animals also they need house yes when it rains when it is very hot when it is cool we need house in the same way animals also need house animals also need house so we will build houses for these animals so that they can see they can be safe in that house farm animals are very useful to us they give us many things so we keep them near our house so they are known as farm animals animals which are useful to us like goat is useful how goat is useful goat gives us mutton hen how hen is useful hen gives us eggs and chicken how cow is useful cow gives us milk so these are farm animals these animals are known as farm animals so they keep they build houses and they keep in farm so animals which are useful to us are known as farm animals next d o m e s t i c domestic d o m e s t i c domestic d o m e s t i c domestic a n i m a l s animals a n i m a l s animals domestic animals d o m e s t i c domestic a n i m a n s animals what are domestic animals the animals that we see near our house are known as domestic animals the animals that we see near our house now dog dog will be moving near our house we can see cow will be moving horse will be moving yes these animals will not harm us yes these animals will not harm us they will be near they we can see them moving near our house yes or no so they are known as domestic animals the animals that live near our house are known as domestic animals the animals that we see near our house are domestic animals wild animals they live in forest because when they are dangerous animals domestic animals they live near our house we can see them moving near our house so they won't harm us so they are near our house these animals are known as domestic animals farm animals means the animals which are useful to us we keep them in farm so they are known as farm animals p l o u g h plow you saw no farmers plowing the land before putting seeds what they will do they will plow the land means they will make the soil loose they will make the soil loose how the soil will be very hard no on the hard soil we can put anything to grow no so before putting anything before they want to grow anything rice wheat sugar cane what they will do they will plow the land plow means they will make the soil loose after that they will put seeds in that so that plants will grow h o r s e horse h o r s e horse you all know horse animal yes you can see horse moving d o n k e y donkey d o n k e y donkey p e t pet a n i m a l s animals pet animals 
what are pet animals the animals that we keep in our house they do that animals also stay in our house they are known as pet animals yes now dog fish cat rabbit yes parrot these animals we keep as pet in our house they live with us in our house they are known as pet animals farm animals they will they will live near our house but pet animals they will live in our house yes pet animals we should only take care of the pet animals if dog is there we will take kennel for dog that is the house of the dog it stays in that kennel yes fish if we have fishes we keep a aquarium for the fishes if we have parrot we keep a cage for the parrot so pet animals are animals which live with us in our house w i n g s wings who will have wings animals will have wings birds will have wings why this bird birds have wings they use these wings to fly they use the wings to fly wings help them to fly wings help them to fly birds will have wings f e a t h e r s feathers yes for wings what will be there feathers will be there yes you saw no um, peacock feather we can see many birds feathers on the ground many times yes they are feathers wings and feathers we can see for a bird we can see for birds w i n g s wings f e a t h e r s feathers f e a t h e r s feathers w i n g s wings w i n g s wings f e a t h e r s feathers wings feathers s p a r r o w sparrow sparrow is a bird sparrow is a bird s p a r r o w sparrow s p a r r o w sparrow p i g e o n pigeon we can see sparrow pigeon near our house yes p i g e o n pigeon p i g e o n pigeon p i g e o n pigeon p e n g u i n penguin p e n g u i n penguin see this is penguin yes penguin bird this is penguin p e n g u i n penguin p e n g u i n penguin o s t r i c h ostrich o s t r i c h ostrich see this is ostrich big bird ostrich is a big bird o s t r i c h ostrich o s t r i c h ostrich p e l i c a n pelican pelican is a bird that lives in water that swims in water pelican is a bird that swims in water like the cow duck lives in water no pelican also can swim in water p e l i c a n pelican now shall we read all these words once again yes a n i m a l s animals a n i m a l s animals g i r a f f e giraffe g i r a f f e giraffe g i r a f f e giraffe you two should say with me then only you will learn the words come on read e l e p h a n t elephant e l e p h a n t elephant e l e p h a n t elephant r h i n o c e r o s rhinoceros r h i n o c e r o s rhinoceros r h i n o c e r o s rhinoceros m o u s e mouse m o u s e mouse m o u s e mouse s q u i r r e l squirrel s q u i r r e l squirrel 
S Q U I R R E L squirrel Z E B R A zebra Z E B R A zebra Z E B R A zebra M O N K E Y monkey M O N K E Y monkey M O N K E Y monkey T U R T L E turtle T U R T L E turtle T U R T L E turtle D O L P H I N dolphin D O L P H I N dolphin D O L P H I N dolphin S A L A M A N D E R salamander S A L A M A N D E R salamander C R O C O D I L E crocodile C R O C O D I L E crocodile C R O C O D I L E crocodile F O R E S T forest F O R E S T forest F O R E S T forest W I L D wild A N I M A L S animals wild animals W I L D wild A N I M A L S animals wild animals W I L D wild A N I M A L S animals wild animals F A R M S forms F A R M S forms F A R M S forms D O M E S T I C domestic D O M E S T I C domestic A N I M A L S animals A N I M A L S animals domestic animals P L O U G H plow P L O U G H plow P L O U G H plow H O R S E horse H O R S E horse H O R S E S E H O R S E horse H O R S E horse D O N K E Y donkey D O N K E Y donkey D O N K E Y donkey P E T pet A N I M A L S animals pet animals P E T pet A N I M A L S animals pet animals W I N G S wings W I N G S wings W I N G S wings F E T H E R S feathers F E T H E R S feathers F E T H E R S feathers S P A R R O W sparrow S P A R R O W sparrow S P A R R O W sparrow P I G E O N pigeon P I G E O N pigeon P I G E O N pigeon P E N G U I N penguin P E N G U I N penguin P E N G U I N penguin O S T R I C H ostrich O S T R I C H ostrich O S T R I C H ostrich P E L I C A N pelican P E L I C A N pelican P E L I C A N pelican Yes, what is your homework? You will write this new terms in your classwork. Okay? Homework H W.
W R I T E write lesson twelve N E W new T E R M S terms I N in C W you will write these new terms in C W and you will learn you will learn all these words okay you will read and you will learn all the new terms you will write lesson number lesson name and new terms. All the first letters start with capital letter. You can draw one center line. Don't divide the paper like this in three parts. You will divide the paper into only two parts and you will write both the sides. Okay. Do your work neatly and after writing, you will read each word three, three times and you should know all the spellings. All Mostly all these are names of animals and birds. You should be able to say all the names of birds and animal spellings. You should know. So learn each word five, five times. Till you get the word, you should learn and read all the spellings and learn and write it with good and neat handwriting. Thank you children.